So one of the things that we're going to be looking at in this series is how to create a flowchart. That is a visual representation of an algorithm or a way that we solve a problem. Now there's a lot of ways that we can create flowcharts. This includes everything from writing out with a pen and some paper or using a variety of applications, even something like Microsoft Word. However, we have found that sometimes it's best to use a tool that's designed for creating graphics in order to do it. Now, you don't have to have a fancy application like Photoshop. In fact, Photoshop or Illustrator is not only overkill, it would actually be more difficult. So what we're going to do is use a tool called Lucidchart. And they have a free sign up that you can use. It doesn't require a credit card or anything. And all you have to do is just sign up to use it. Now, the free version is limited, but it has a lot of different features that you can still use. And if you want to go further, you can pay for them. Let's take a quick look. Now, I provide a link in the description below, and all you have to do is paste that into your address bar of your web browser, and it'll go right here. And there's a sign up for free, or if you want to take a look at pricing, this will help you see some of the other features that are available and what it costs. Now, the nice thing is, is that not only can you create these charts, you can also share them with other people. So if you work on a group project, this is great. I'm going to just click the start free here. And you'll notice that you have your name, a work email, and a password. And that's all you need to do. Or you can continue with and install it using a single sign-on from either Google, Microsoft Office 365, or Slack, whichever you prefer. Now, once you do that, go ahead and check out the next video, which is coming up, to see how you can start with Lucidchart.